Hey guys, hope you're well. Hope you're having a lovely weekend. Um, just wanted to bring you another quick video um, about what I'm doing, especially about the portfolio. I had some excellent questions come through, so thank you for everybody who's participating in asking these questions, especially the ones with regards to Casper. I think we are building a fantastic community where the questions and answers are actually quite relevant to the project rather than just um, blindly believe in whatever you hear out there so you guys have contributed to my knowledge and and i'm learning from you as much as i'm trying to provide you with some updates on uh, on casper but um yeah just uh just a quick video really just before i get into it uh like the video subscribe and uh let's let's dive into it because i want to make it quick for you guys so as you can see guys you know casper other projects pumping um in this month no surprise at all there there are things like render uh that are down at the moment possibly a good buying opportunity but overall again pepe's on discount at 14 percent there but uh overall i mean you know you'd you'd expected this but if we look at the um the hourly again you know the market is pretty decent right now and um i was expecting tau to come down and it has and uh yeah so QNT is up actually, which is which is nice to see QNT um, QNT rallying a little bit. It's been flat for a while, uh, which is always good in terms of a, uh, you know kind of accumulating. But uh, yeah, guys, look, you know, in the bubbles, you know, here's some, you know, today I wanted to talk about my kind of top picks for cryptos going up to the uh, going up to the next bull market, and and I hold some of these projects. Uh, uh at the moment and obviously casper is my um uh, my main main project within the um within this entire list so you can see where i'm up where i'm down and um what, what's happening between some of these are actually projects that i haven't bought into it yet uh but some of them i definitely hold as, as i will be showing you and actually the question today was again inspired by someone who was asking me what do i recommend and what's my kind of top picks for the for the next bull market and uh before i actually jump into that i want to thank the guy who was asking me about the uh what the dca means and i hope i can show you in the video what dca means because what we're trying to do here is teach people how to do things independently if you need to actually grab some uh casper best place to grab it in my description of the video you can get it from kucoin and you can get it from uh mexi so yeah with that being said guys look wanted to talk about kind of my talk what i'm holding as as cryptos as you know i have many different cryptos um across the uh across the board and uh somebody was asking me you know what, what's my largest holdings and what what is my kind of investment range in for this uh for this next bull market so with casper guys you know the target here is one million okay so right now casper is i've put an average price because i don't want to lie to myself and say i'm gonna buy casper even though my dollar cost average is l lower than four uh four cents my number one coin um right now as it stands is casper okay and you can see i'm, I'm allocating overall i think i will probably allocate around you know um probably around thirty thousand dollars hopefully into the into the project overall uh so my my investment value should be able to come down but if i did nothing from this point onwards i'm i'm almost certain that if you know casper goes to this one dollar i'll be good to take profit at you know 250k we know casper um the predictions range from a dollar to ten dollars um but if i get you know obviously if i get my holdings up to to the million tokens then obviously i'm like i'm targeting a million usd in terms of in terms of my profit and obviously anybody who lives in dubai uh we obviously calculate that in uae dirham here so that's what AED is and Dubai is an interesting place I mean if you become a Casper millionaire 
one of the things you can do in Dubai, you know, crypto is not taxed. The laws are fantastic and, and you know, it's a crypto friendly country. Uh, so this is where I would probably say, you know, spend, spend some of your money or take profits instead of paying large amounts of tax, but obviously not financial advice. At the moment, I, I'm holding around 200. Um, I'm kind of holding this 200 um, Solanas. And I go into Solana between, you know, kind of uh, $8 and $20. And, um, you know, right now I'm predicting that Solana, you know, between a 250, you know, I've got to be realistic with that. My overall aim was to at least get 100,000 from that. But I might have to reposition some of the, um, so, so, some of my, uh, or the size of my bag. The target here for me is always, you know, try to get into uh 1000 souls if you can um so 1k is is probably the target there and uh yeah so solana is one of my bigger positions and you can see here how i'm positioned myself uh a 4000 investment into a hundred thousand dollars will it do it i mean i'd probably say if it, if it goes to half of the 500 i'm good to go uh, and same with QNT. I mean, QNT is a crypto that I absolutely love. Um, and currently I have about 25 of these. I'm going to be working towards the 100 mark. So 100 QNT should be able to set you up. Um, I do have small QNT in a ledger. Um, I think I have about another 10. So probably I'm more closer to the uh, 35 than I am to the 25 there. So yeah, uh, number one holding Casper, I would probably say gets a tick. Solana will probably get a, a smaller tick because I'm still looking to see whether we can go to this all time highs or we, whether we can double at least on the previous all time high. Some people are even saying, I mean, I've previously did a video that said, could Solana go to a thousand dollars? So all in on Casper, in on Solana, in on QNT, and then I will talk about, so what I will do, I'll probably separate the video, uh, into two. So my, 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 you know, my, again, this other side of the portfolio, I will talk about it because I need to update majority of these tokens. Okay. So let's not even think about that, but number one, Casper, number two, Solana, number three, Quant, number four, HBAR. And what I've tried to do with these guys is try to secure the bag as quickly as I, as quickly as I could, so I can make my, I can work my way down here. Okay, down here, fill the rest of the portfolio. And that's how you've got to think. So once you get your top four, I'd probably say top five, um, then work your way down because I've got other, other projects here. You know, I've got, I've got a small bag of GFAL. I've got a speculative place here. You know, XP Network has been doing fantastic for me. I have XDC, however, I don't, I, I hold it on an exchange, but I've done very well out of XDC and it should be up in my, um, my rankings. I have significant amounts of Gala over here. Of course, UFA Gaming, I hold all of these on Ledger, including uh, Chain GBT. So the ultimate aim, guys, is, is to get your cryptos, uh, work your way into, into the positions that you want fill up a position and work your way down. When I initially started on crypto, uh, and this is quite key for me, uh, this is probably what, what I look at. So when I made this plan, I said to myself, okay, you know, if, I, if I'm going into a Casper and I'm in the, let's say for example, I know Casper, I'm, I'm more convinced more than ever that Casper is gonna be here, okay? So initially I thought Casper, some people will be taking profit there and rightly so, but, but I think we can easily start to think about this. So this is where I am right now. Okay. So that level is done. Now, what do I want to do next in the next coming weeks, months, I want to be able to complete, um, the, the 500,000. Okay. And then obviously for the rest of the year, I will try and DCA into 
into that into that exclusive club here, one million, okay? Uh, and then obviously you can sell a small percentage of that. So for everything that you see here, um, there is obviously a plan. But of course, you know, the reason I talk about Casper is because I know Casper is my blue chip. Casper is my kind of um, number one pick. You know, there's other things that I hold. I have about 40 different cryptos uh, to a certain degree, but this is kind of like the current DCA or what I'm actually focusing on. Um, you know, other things that I, I, I will be able to bring you is this uh, Zen Mints. You know, I mint Zen and, um, you know, Pulse. You know, this is a controversial project that I'm in and, and so on and so on. So, so look, guys, like the video. Um, you know, I love the questions that you're asking me. I love the fact that you're inspiring me and challenging me about my convictions in Casper. A lot of the times we're learning about, you know, Nightshade, Ghost Dag, other things the development team is working on. And uh, if you look at the, um, if you actually look at the, the chart, we, you know, we are in this kind of sideways uh, momentum right now. We've obviously taken a small dips here and there, but I, I, you know, like I said to you guys, I'm already up in my average cost for Casper saying to myself, realistically, I'm actually mentally getting in at four cents. So anything that I buy below four cents is a win for me. So with that being said, man, thank you for joining me. Have a lovely rest of the Sunday, wherever you are in the world, wherever you're doing. And uh, yeah, like the video, um, share the content and uh, I'll see you on the uh, next one. Cheers, guys. Take care.